Last year, I paid little to no taxes, and today I'm gonna to show you in this video how I did it. The great thing about the United States is you can leverage to pay little to no taxes legally. You just have to understand what those are and have also people around you who know more than you on what those tax benefits are. The main reason why I'm in this house today is because of the tax deductions I could do through my business. A big exemption that I can get out of this home if I wanted to sell it was if I transferred the money to another property, which is called a 1031 exchange. In other words, the capital gains is exempted when you're looking for another property doing a 1031 exchange. But the long term for this property, I want to keep for an office for my landscape company. So right now it's a house, I'm living in it, I have roommates living in it, but sooner or later I wanna transfer it to an office for the landscape company and to utilize it that way. A second way that I can write off a lot of taxes is having my company lease space or garage um, from me personally. And so since I have three garage bays that we utilize, I use one of them as just-in-time lawn care and lease out the other two to my roommates. By your company leasing from you personally, you get to deduct a lot of those taxes. Now the IRS has some stipulations on this one, but you can actually tax exempt your home office if you are the homeowner working there. There's also one more I wanna mention, it's the homestead deduction. I know you might be thinking like, bro, why are you talking about taxes? Well, I'm just sharing you some of the things that have made me not have to pay taxes to the IRS. And that's why most of the time you see the wealthy not paying any taxes legally. It's because they got the right legal counsel, they got the right attorneys, they got the right CPAs, the right team searching and literally studying the tax code. And I'm just saying like, why the frick would you wanna pay the IRS when you could use that money to give back to other people or do good in the world? Like what's the government gonna do with your money? They're gonna use it in foolish ways. To me, that's just how I see it. So basically what your homestead deduction does is it lowers your property taxes depending on your assessed value. It has to be below 600,000. If you're looking to buy real estate or invest in real estate long-term, there's so many exemptions and deductions that you can take advantage of legally. So the biggest thing I'm using this real estate property for is house hacking. So I'm living here for free from the rents for my roommates and then cash flowing on top of that. In addition, having those tax advantages and tax deductions with the property. Now, I'm not a tax genius, nor do I wanna be, but I really wanna know this stuff long-term as I get bigger and wealthier, so then I don't have to pay these taxes legally. And so it's just more money and more resources that I get to give back to the world rather than giving it to the government. The other thing I wanted to mention, is like, it's just funny how our schools don't teach this kind of stuff how you can avoid taxes legally and how you can build and generate wealth for yourself and for your family and to be a blessing to others. Like bro, the school systems are so broke. They're based off information from the Great Depression. And so I'm just saying, man, like it could help if they updated some things on not how to be trained as an employee, but as an employer. And yeah, I'm only 20 years old, but I know enough to realize that this can help a lot of people if they understood the right information. But sadly, the school systems teach the same information year after year. And guess what? Old information is not going to help you grow. It might help you in the past to grow, but definitely not in the future. The future needs innovation in order to grow. Yo, I hope you found this video interesting. I have a lot of different videos on this channel that you should check out. Please like and subscribe and give me a comment. I really want to see your guys' feedback so I can improve these videos to bring you the best content I can. God bless and we'll catch you later.